Hello everyone, this is Something Doc 2, and welcome to another Fabric Mod overview. This time on I Need Keybinds, a mod that allows you to set up different commands or interactions with a keybinding menu here. And you can access this from Mod Menu or the Ink Config command, which I haven't actually attempted yet. But um, yeah, you pretty much just bind a bunch of commands or certain actions like so. So we'll go to mod menu, you've got the following there, and you've got some things like I've got a command set up there, I've got an interaction with placing or using an item or block, or I can drop them, and uh, yeah, all these will mostly be um, blank by default, and I've just filled them in instead, and you can obviously change the, change the animation duration, which I think mostly applies to the key binding menu rather than your interactions. Um, so I can obviously name that to whatever I want, and I can just say uh, give apples or something. I can set this up with obviously adding a new one, which I don't need to for this here, but I can go edit. I can put in a command here if I want, or I can select one of these instead, and it'll give me the command, and that's what I want it to be. Otherwise, if I didn't want this to be use or place block, I could put it to attack and destroy. And select it, and it will be fine. Then I can apply it with save changes. I'm just going to put that back. Go ink config, and that should also do the same. So to access it, you'll go zero on the keypad by default, and obviously it's going fairly fast due to the animation speed that I set up here. It's so obviously 300 milliseconds by default, but if we go to 5 seconds and apply that, it would take a bit to exit, and it will take a bit to enter in again. So to actually use this, besides just putting the menu up every so often and removing it, you just press the key, uh, the number key on your keypad, and obviously now. If I press 1 again, it'll give me apples. If I press 0, it'll allow me to access any of the others again. You should be able to change at least the 0, 1 by default, as well as probably some of the others as well. Any controls? Uh, these controls obviously won't apply to the ones as part of the mod. Every other one above it should, because of the possibilities they give. And uh, I can obviously press 2, and I can press 1 to place a block. I can hold it down if I want to make a crazy building attempt there. Or I can obviously go to 3 and I can drop blocks because I've suggested that I want it to do that on that key. And I can access my inventory. Or I can close it again. Or I can access advancements and close it again. Or I can access chat and I can access it like so. It won't obviously close it for me, but still open it, and if I go to 8, I can then clear my inventory or I want to move on to something else. And that's 6 with sprinting, or sneaking, so you can have multiple on 1. Actually change sneak to something else, for example. You should get a better way of approaching each of those. So instead of sprint, we'll go for say jump, I guess. Uh, for both different interactions to put on that. Hold on. So we'll jump, we can sneak, and also jump and sneak at the same time. And you can apply multiple onto each if you wish, or just use the basic one you want for that. So if I wanted to say a command only one, I could give myself apples, I could um, Teleport somewhere, I could do a bunch of other bits and pieces and then exit out every so often to the next thing if I want, or completely remove it from the screen, from my view. Otherwise, thanks so much for watching and goodbye!